What's good, homies? We about to be litty, no cap. You found the Madden plug. Now hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell on. I'm about to put you on. Coin making methods, no money spent tips, budget beats on the 500 bands, 300 bands, 100 bands. Whatever you need, I got you. I got that daily Madden work. Now let's get it. You heard? Damn, son. Another one. Say, hey, yo. Hey, yo. No shmoney spank gang. We in a building and you just know that. What is shaking, yo? You already know what time it is, man. Holla at me. If you're new to the channel, man, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell to frock on. We's all the way to frock. Let you dig. You already know. If it's your first time on this channel, man, check it out. I'm about to show you a graph. A graph just like this. And I do this type of graph for every single promo that comes out. And what I'm doing on this graph is I'm, I'm looking for budget beasts. And I'm taking those budget beasts and I'm comparing them to the best card in that position. If not the most expensive card in that position. I'm here to help you say some chicken you dig. With that being said, hey yo, Super Bowl, man. Damn, son. Super Bowl. Pass, yo, shout out to the Goonies, man, yo, yo, I ain't gonna lie to you, man, they dropped a lot of fire, man, a lot of fire, we're gonna go over the cars, man, and you know, we're gonna compare them to some budget beasts, man, you already know, man, come on, come on, big dog, let's talk about it, man, first call we're gonna be talking about, yo, where Doug Williams at, yo, surprisingly, for as good as this card is, 600k but you know the slogan right 600k we ain't gonna pay so we gotta compare my man doug williams okay to the ball rest in peace to the big homie man rest in peace to air mother fucking McNair. Another 600k. Now his value did go down from like 1.5 million down to 600k. This is a huge L for the community. I mean, huge W for the community. My fault, y'all. Huge W. And we're also gonna throw in there the ball, CJ Stroud, who you know what I mean. I told y'all he was lit, man. I told y'all don't don't sleep on that release. He he's still lit, man. All right. Shout out to the Brody. 1.2 milli. Yo, a milli, bro. Anyways, we're gonna compare these two dudes. You know we gotta throw them in it. To me, yo, this dude is lit. Lit, 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 lit. My man Josh Allen going for about yo, you can actually get him for cheaper. Hold on, hold on. Josh Allen going for about 220 bands. Yo, this card is fire. I got it. I got it for free. And we're gonna throw in there Jordan Love just to see what's shaking. You already know for the young, for the smaller budget beast. You know what I mean? For for the 100k Goonies, you already know. Anyways, from left to right, we got Air McNair. Shout out to the homie Steve McNair. Traditional full release in blue. In red, we got CJ Stroud, traditional two release. In green, we got Doug Williams, traditional four release. Arguably the best release in the game. In purple, we got Josh Allen, slinger three release. And in the baby blue, the classic slinger one release. Jordan Love, you already know. When it comes to speed, McNair and Stroud both 93. Williams 92, Allen 90, Love 92. When it comes to throw power, McNair 96, Stroud 95, Williams 96, Allen and Love both 95. When it comes to short accuracy, McNair and Stroud both 94, Williams 90, Allen 91, Love 92. When it comes to medium accuracy, McNair, 95 OPAO, CJ Stroud, 92, Williams and Allen, both 90, 
Love, 91. Deep Accuracy, McNair, 91. Stroud, Williams, both 92. Allen, OP, 96. Hey, yo, Jordan Love, 90. When it comes to throw under pressure, one of the most important attributes when it comes to quarterback, Brody's McNair, 96. Stroud and Williams, both 97. Allen, 95. Love, 93. Listen, Brody's, is, is Williams worth 600K? Listen, it's the same price as Ed McNair. Same release. Don't, you know what I mean? Like, they, they, identical release, identical price. But look at the, st look at the stats, okay? My man Williams, 96 throw power, same as McNair. When it comes to short accuracy, Williams 90, McNair 94. Medium, Williams 90, McNair 95. Okay, deep, Williams 92, McNair 91. Throw under pressure, Williams 97, McNair 96. Obviously, McNair is one speed faster. When it comes to abilities, Williams comes with Hot Rod Master for 1 AP, Sefi Lee for 4 AP. So, in theory, in theory, ability-wise, it'll probably even out. But I think, honestly, Doug Williams will beat him with the abilities. But statistically, I think Steve McNair is probably actually better. Okay? Just for the simple fact. You know what I mean? A lot of these, look, they get almost the same thing except um, McNair gets Gunslinger for 1 AP. Williams gets it for 2 AP. You see what I'm saying? So, I like, I don't know. I mean, they just about the same when it comes to abilities. I think, like I said, I think Williams actually beats him by 1, maybe. But... Statistically, I like McNair better. Just saying, same release, same everything. But my man Allen, budget B is bando. You dig what I'm saying, man? 90 speed, not the super fastest, but 95 throw power, 91 short, 90 medium, 96 deep, and 95 throwing the pressure is a solid budget budget beast. He gonna get the job done. But don't sleep on Jordan Love neither, man. Okay, 92 speed, 95 throw power, 92 short, 91 medium, 90 deep, 93. It's a solid card still. If I had to pick between McNair and Williams, ability-wise, I'll probably go Williams. Just keeping it a thousand. Statistically, I'll probably go McNair. Y'all know how y'all know I, I keep it a thousand with y'all, man. Anyways, let's get into wide receiver. They ended up, yo, listen. For those of you guys that don't know, all right, listen, I'm a, let me give you some history. All right? My man right here. New York stand the fuck up, by the way. Brooklyn in the building. You already know. You already know. Anyways, for those of you guys that don't know, my man Plexico Burris. Yes, in New York, we call him Plexico Burris, bro. Ain't nobody out here calling him Plexico. We call him Plexico, all right? Two milli. Hey, yo, for those of you guys that don't know, my man right here, he shot himself <laughs> in the leg. Yo, back in the days. That's all, that's all the way. To, you don't believe me, man? Google the shit. You know what I mean? Like, just all the way a thousand. We got to compare him. <laughs> We got to compare to Brody. Yeah. <laughs> yo, nigga, he, yo, he hit you with a cheddar bob and shot himself in the leg. Stop playing, man. Stop playing. Anyways, we're going to compare him to, of course, we got to throw Megatron in there. 1.8 milli. Hey, yo, you already know. We're going to throw in there some budget beats. I'm going to throw in there Randy Moss for the simple fact that he is an LTD. You're going to see some LTDs hop out today because I think they're a good price. I've seen him for as low as 450 bands with the 350 quick sell value. That means you're paying 100K for the Goonie, all right? Then we're also going to throw in there Rod Smith. Where's Rod Smith at? Rod Smith, I like because he gets wide receiver, wide receiver apprentice for one AP. I can't even find the ball. Where the ball at? Yo, I can't even. I can't, there you go, right there. Hey, yo, stop playing. Y'all be, y'all be, y'all be OD with it, man. Anyways, right? If, if y'all happen to find Rod Smith, homeboy's lit. Okay, he's going for about 280 bands, 94 overall. Rod Smith, and we're going to throw in there free 99 Jerry Rice that you get from the field pass just so you guys can see where Jerry Rice does stack up. All right, so from left to right, we got Plexico Burris in blue. He is 6'5". Megatron in red, he is 6'5 as well. Randy Moss in green, he is 6'4". Rod Smith in purple, he is 6 foot. And Jerry Rice in the baby blue, he is 6'2". Okay, when it comes to speed. Burris and Megatron both 96, everybody else is 95. Acceleration, Burris 94, 
Megatron 95, Moss 94, Smith 91, Rice 95. Hey yo, when it comes to catching, Burris, Moss, Smith, and Rice all 93, Megatron is a 92. When it comes to short route running, Burris 95, Megatron 93, Moss 91, Smith 95, Rice 93. When it comes to medium route running, Burris 91. Megatron, OP 95, Moss 92, Smith 90, Rice 93. When it comes to deep route running, Burris 96, Megatron 97, Moss and Smith both 93, Rice 94. Now listen, statistically, is Plexico Bur Burris worth 2 milli? 96 speed, 94 excel, 93 catch, 95 short, 91 medium, 96 deep. Yo, it's a fire car, brodies. I mean, he gets, you know what I mean? Like, he, he gets mid in the lead for 1 AP, short in the lead for 1 AP, evasive for 1 AP. I mean, like, come, come on, bro. He's like, this, 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 he gets, he gets deep out of lead, man. I mean, this card is fire. I ain't, I ain't even gonna hold you. I'll fuck with Between this and Megatron, they both fire. They both OP. Randy, Randy Moss still got a shot, though. 95 speed, 94 XL, 93 catch. You know what I mean? Like, you, you, you already know he all the way official. Okay, what makes Plexico Burris so so dope is that he has a 97 spec catch, which makes him the highest in the game. So that's that's what's fire about him. Okay, but don't sleep on my man Randy Moss. S Smith still gonna hold it down to 95 speed. Okay, 95 short, 90 medium is mid, 93 deep is solid, but he gets that wide receiver apprentice for one AP. That's what makes him so dope. And Jerry Rice is fire. You know what I mean? He get deep in the lead for one AP. Route Tech for 1 AP, and he's free. 95 speed, 95 excel, 93 short, 93 medium, 94 deep. It's a fire card as well, too, man. Yo, you already know. Come on, let's let, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Okay, they dropped the homie. They dropped the homie. You already know. You already know where we're going with this, man. Cam Chancellor, 2.5 million. Hey, yo. Fire six three eight yo man, stop playing with him. But you know we gotta compare him to some other people, okay? Number one, my man Ryan Neal went down in price. I love this. This is this is good for us. You get him for as low as three hundred k. This is a fire card, okay? And you know it. And you know it ain't right unless I throw in the big big homie. We talking about the six seven homie. Julius Peppers, where's he at? Right there. Going for 186k. Stop playing with him. This is a steal. This right here, this is a come up. You know what I mean? This is like selling a trade bag for a dime piece. You already know. All right, next up, we got Bo Jack. Why Bo Jack? Because he's an LTD. You get a 350 quick sell value. So you only paying 100k for this. Come on, bro. And it's Bo Jack. And, and they made him an inch taller in this Madden. You know what I mean? Like, you can't even go wrong with it. Last year, he was like six foot. This year, he's six one. Stop playing with him, man. Don't do not do him dirty like that no more, man. Anyways, and we are going to throw in there Pacheco for the simple fact that he is a 94 speed, 140. Stop playing. I'd cop him for 140, man. Like, come on, Brodies. Come on, Brodies. All right, here we go. So, from left to right, we got Cam Chancellor in blue, 6'3". Ryan Neal in red, he is 6'3 as well. Julius Peppers in green, 6'7. Bo Jack in purple, he is 6'1. Isaiah Pacheco, he is 5'10. He is itty bitty. You know what I mean? When it comes to speed, Chancellor, OP96. Hey yo, what the fuck? Ryan Neal, 95. Everybody else is a 94. Acceleration, Chancellor, 92. Neal, 93. Peppers, Super low mid 88. Bojack 95. Pacheco 94. When it comes to jumping, Chancellor, Peppers, and Bojack all OP 95. Neil 93. Pacheco with a weak 88. When it comes to man coverage, Chancellor, Neil, and Peppers all 90. Bojack 93. Pacheco 94. Zone coverage, Chancellor OP 97.
Hey yo, what the fuck? Neil and Peppers, both 95, Bojack 93, Pacheco 95. When it comes to play rec, Chancellor 93, Neil 91, Peppers 94, Bojack with a mid 87, Pacheco 94. This is the only thing that I, like, I really like about Pacheco. 94 man, 95 zone, 94 play rec. Yo, I'd give you 140 for that. Easy shmoney, dog. You know what I mean? But is Chancellor worth two milli? Listen, brodies. The ball gets pick artist for zero AP. Mid zone KO for one AP. Um, deep deep zone KO for two AP. I mean, I mean, come on. I mean, flat zone KO for one AP. I mean, two AP. I mean, the dude is lit. And he's 6'3", 96 speed. You know what I mean? 95 jump. 90 man is mid. 97 zone. 93 play rec. That's a fire card. But you ask me, who would I want? 96, 96 speed, Cam Chancellor? Or Julius Peppers? Bro, I'll be honest with you. For 180 bands, Julius Peppers is a steal. Okay? You know what I mean? And then on top of that, you, you throw in Bo Jack. Bo Jack is still lit. Don't sleep on Bo Jack. And he gets deep in zone KO for 1 AP. The only thing with Bo Jack, though, he don't get like... He don't get pick, He don't get discounted pick on. That's, that's the only thing. But still... 94 speed, 95 excel, 95 jump, 93 man, 93 zone, 87 play rec isn't the greatest, but fire card, and you're only paying for 100 bands. Truthfully, I'd cop Julius Peppers, and I'd cop Neil off top. You already know. Come on, man. Save yourself some chicken, man. But shout out to Chancellor for getting that fire, fire card. That card is lit. All right, here we go. Free safety. You know where we going, man. My man Ronnie Lott. It, it ain't right unless Ron, it ain't right unless EA drops a hundred Ronnie Lott cards a year. You you know I'm right. Anyways, Ronnie Lott going for 666k. Stop playing with him, man. Don't play with the ball, man. You already know. We're gonna compare him to, of course. You know we gotta find Eric Berry. Battle of the Legends. Where's Eric Berry at? Eric Berry's a 95, right? Where's he at? Find out, oh, Eric Berry actually, psh, 800 bands, stop playing with it. We're going to com compare Eric Berry to Ronnie Lott. We're also going to throw in there Malik Hooker, who's still fire, even though he's short. 240K, this is, a, this is a fire sale. Same thing with Darnell Savage. We're throwing all four of these dudes on a chart. We're going to see what's shaking out here. You know what I mean? Pause. From left to right, we got Eric Berry in blue. He is six foot. Ronnie Lott in red, he is six foot. Malik Hooker, 6'1". He is in green. Darnell Savage in purple. He is 5'11". When it comes to speed, Barry and Lott both 96. Hooker, 95. Savage, 94. When it comes to acceleration, Barry, Lott both 92. Hooker, 94. Savage, 96. When it comes to jumping, Barry, Lott, Savage, all 95. Malik Hooker, 94. When it comes to zone coverage, Barry, 91. Lot, Hooker, both 93. Savage, 91. When it comes to zone coverage, Barry, 96. Lot, 97. Hooker, 95. Savage, 94. Play rec, Barry, 91. Lot, 90. Hooker, 89. Savage, 93. Now, let, let me tell you this. All of these dudes right here get pick artists for zero AP. So it don't really matter. If you if you get Malik Hooker and Darnell Savage, both 90, 95, 94 speed, you're getting pick artists for zero AP. Okay? And they got solid, solid stats. Malik Hooker, 93 man, 95 zone. Darnell Savage, 91 man, 94 zone. Pick artists, zero AP. And they both get deep in zone KO for one AP. But we're here to talk about Ronnie Lott, right? 96 speed, 95 jump, 93 man, 97 zone. 90 play rank. And he gets pick artist for 0 AP. Enforcer for 1 AP. He does not get... Oh, he also... You can also get a uh, deep zone KO for 2 AP. I mean, come on, bro. This, this card is fire. Ability is fire. Am I going to drop a bag on him? I'm probably not. But if you did, dope for you. Mad love. You know what I mean? Ronnie Lott, 600 and something K. Fire card. But I could get Malik Hooker and Darnell Savage for both... I get both of them for that price. 
So shout out to Ronnie Lott getting the five card. That joint, all these cards is lit, Brody. To be honest with you, man. All these cards is lit. Now let's talk about another one. Another fire card that they dropped, man. I'm telling you, this Super Bowl promo is lit. Okay? Herb Adderley. Where's the boy? 95 overall, Herb Adderley. This is probably who I would take as the free 95. BNT. 600 bands. Hey, yo. Fire, John. Okay? Let's get it. Adderley, we got to compare you to the fastest corner in the game. That's going to be Jair Alexander. Going for the 1.1 1. 1 milli. Hey, yo. But we're going to throw in there some budget beasts. One budget beast I really, really like. And I don't know if everybody digging it too, but I like it. I like the abilities. I like the speed. 260K, Rondé Barber. We're throwing him in there. We're also going to throw in there Steven Nelson. 270 bands. And we need to throw in there the Rattler. Where's the Rattler? 325k stop playing with them let's take a look at these stats so you guys can't see where they where they st stack up at okay from left to right Jair Alexander in blue he is 510 Adderley in red 61 Rondé Barber in green he is 510 Nelson in purple 511 the Rattler Ken Riley in the baby blue he is 511 okay when it comes to speed Alexander and Adderley both 96. These are the fastest corners in the game. Everybody else is a 95. Acceleration. Alexander, 95. Adderley, 91. Barber, 93. Nelson, 94. Riley, 91. When it comes to jumping, Jair Alexander, OP, 97. Dumb, are you dumb? Stupid, I'm dumb. Huh? That is OP, Brody's. OP. Adderley, 94. Barber, 91. Nelson and Riley, both 94. When it comes to man coverage, Alexander, 96. Adderley, 95. Barber, 94. Nelson, 93. Riley, 95. When it comes to zone coverage, Alexander, 94. Adderley and Barber, both 95. Nelson, 90. Riley, 95. When it comes to press, Alexander, 92. Adderley, 94. Barber, mid-89. Nelson and Riley, both 94. And again, let me say this again. All of these dudes come with pick artists for zero AP. You know what I mean? Is Adderley lit? Is he lit? 96 speed, lit off top. 94 jump. 95 man, 95 zone, 94 press. Hey, yo. Yo, this card is fire. <laughs> it is fire. Pick card is 0 AP, flat zone KO for 1 AP, mid zone KO for 1 AP, and you can get deep zone KO for 2 AP. Bro, this card is hot. Hot. Alexander's still fire, too. But ability wise, Adelie's gonna pro. Yo, dead. He's dead. As, yo, official. Now, Rondé Barber to me, still fire. Out of Barber, Nelson, and Riley, truthfully, statistically, who I think is actually better, I'm going to say probably Riley. 95 man, 95 zone, 94 press. You're going to pay a little bit more for him, but if you run a man or any kind, he's he's fire. 5'11", though, but he does have a 94 jump, so you good there. Nelson, 93 man, 90 zone, 94 press. I like that as well. Now, why I like Barber a little bit more is because he's cheaper. Okay, I'm a cheap dude. Pick artist for 0 AP, mid zone KO for 1 AP, mid route KO for 1 AP. Come on, bro. These 95 speed, bro. Come on, just just cop him, throw him on the, you know, it don't even matter, bro. You know what I mean? Like, he, he, he got like a 91 jump. It's not like terrible. Anyways, let's look at the next card. The next card is going to be my man TD, man. Terrell Davis. To me, he becomes the best running back in the game. 600 bands. You already know, man. 600K. We're going to compare him to... Yo, honestly, there's, there's a lot of good running backs out there in the game right now, man. So I wouldn't even be mad at you for any one of these dudes that you pick. Pause. We are going to compare him. Two, where's where's MJD? All these dudes going for dirt cheap, so we're gonna we're gonna put in there Ricky Williams, 230 bands. MJD, 250 bands. We also gotta throw in there Icky. Icky's a little bit pricier. 
We're also going to throw in that Pacheco. Where's Pacheco at? 200? Nah, chill. Pacheco still on the 270. You, this is the lowest I saw him. You get him for about 270. Where's Icky? We're throwing Icky in. He's probably the priciest one out of all of them. Okay. Icky's going for about 380k. You know what I mean? So don't, don't get guy out there. But let's take a look at the graph so you guys can't see where these dudes stack up. Okay. Now we got Terrell Davis in blue. Okay. Mar Maureen, Maurice Jones drew in red. Icky Woods in green. Isaiah Pacheco in purple. Ricky Williams in the baby blue. I still like this Ricky Williams card. Okay. When it comes to speed. Davis. 96. Drew. Woods. Pacheco all 95 Williams 94 when it comes to acceleration Davis 94 Drew 92 Icky OP 98 Pacheco 95 Williams 92 when it comes to carry Davis 90 Jones Drew I mean, Drew 91 Icky 89 Pacheco 94 Williams 93 when it comes to change of direction Davis, 96, Drew, 91, Icky, 95, Pacheco, mid-89, Williams, 94. When it comes to Truckee, Davis, 92, Drew and Icky, both 94, Pacheco, 92, Williams, 93. When it comes to break tackle, Davis, 95, Drew, 96, Icky and Pacheco, both 94, Williams 92. Now, truthfully, man, when you look at the truck and, and you look at the brake tackle, all these dudes turn up. Okay? The ones that really stand out is the change of direction ones. Davis. Icky. Williams. I, I would still frux. I would still frux with Drew, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. I like the stats on him. He got a nine, 94 truck, 96 brake tackle, and he comes with running back apprentice for 1 AP. The dudes that do come with running back apprentice for 1 AP here. It's going to be Williams, Pacheco, Drew. That's the only ones. Davis, uh, Davis and Icky, they're more like trucking backs. But this Terrell Davis card is fine. I can't even lie. 96 speed, 94 excel, 90 carry, 96 change direction is OP, 92 truck, 95 brake tackle. It comes with Energizer for 0 AP, Evasive for 1 AP, Short and Elite for 1 AP. This card is fire. Okay? But I wouldn't even be mad at you if you picked any one of these cars. I think they all fire. My favorite ones would be uh, Williams and Icky. I like Icky a lot, but Icky, like I said, he's more of a trucking back. If you want, like, one with running back apprentice, you got Pacheco, but I'm not digging. You know what I mean? The change of direction isn't the greatest, but him and, him and Drew kind of mirror each other. So it's just, you know, preference. If you want more of a trucker between the two, I would say go Drew. You know what I mean? Like, that's why I would pick. I, I like that Drew card. I like it a lot, truthfully. All right, let's get into the last position. I am i don't. I wasn't even going to do this card. You know what I mean? But I'm going to do it just because. Okay? It's going to be a fast card. Nothing too crazy. We're going to talk about... You, you, you know I don't like this position. But anyways, defensive tackle. Shout out to the homie. Shout out to the homie Warren Sapp. <laughs> Legend, legend. Okay, we're gonna compare him to Chris Jones, who you can get for free on the field pass, and we are gonna be throwing in there 92 overall Aaron Donald because he may not have the abilities because he's outdated, but he still has the statistics. Okay, 140k. I still got him on my squad. I still turn up on my squad. Okay. But I'll be honest with you, man. This 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 Warren Sapp car, OP is a motherfucker. Yo, I ain't gonna lie to you. It's, it's OP, okay? Warren Sapp in blue. He is 6'2", 303. Chris Jones in red, 6'6", 300 pounds. Him being the biggest one. Pause. Aaron Donald in green. He is 6'1", 280 pounds, okay? When it comes to speed, Sapp, 90. Jones and Terminator both 88. Acceleration, Sap 86. Jones 84. Donald 90. When it comes to tackling, Sap 90. Jones 93. Donald 85. When it comes to Blackshed, Warren Sap OP. 
D, 98. Wow. 98, Brodies. Jones, 90. Donald, 92. When it comes to power move, Sap and Jones, both 94. Donald, 92. Finesse move, Sap, OP, 95. Jones, 85. Donald, 92. Now, Warren Sap, zero AP secure tackler. One AP inside stuff. One AP double or nothing. One AP interior threat. This card is, is, is stupid, bro. This is OP. Okay? But from the stats, you can see 98 blocks, 94 power move, 95 finesse move. He is the fastest DT in the game. Okay? 300 pounds. Fire jump. Who can compete with him? Obviously, Chris Jones. Not in speed. I mean, he does get inside stuff for 1 AP, under pressure for 1 AP. 88 speed, though. 93 tackle, 90 block shed, 94 power move, 85. It's a, it's a solid card. Statistically, though, I think Aaron Donald could keep up with him. 90 excel. 85 tackling, though, 92 block shed, 92 power move, 92 finesse move. I still like Aaron Donald. Anyways, if this video helped you out, hit that like, hit that subscribe, and turn that naughty bell to fuck on, you dig? Oh, <laughs>